Hey guys, as promised, I'm stuffed and I want to give you an update on the controller. We just got done, first test. Got it hooked up to 240 and this is the new particle operated Wi-Fi controller I see here. <coughs> Some things are going to change, so I'm not going to quite release it yet, but this is an electric version. <clears throat> and show you what we got going on here. Two solid state relays, power supply, I got a particle, a little board I made, a screen, and I got four buttons to operate it, but we got a bunch of different readouts here. And we can go to meat probes and turn them on and off. We have our set points. We got a manual output mode, the temp, and then they I have a smoke element kind of like the other one, a separate element just for smoke, and then our alarm temp. Menu's easier to go through than before now instead of just having one button to index through. We have PID settings and Wi-Fi. I'm going to go ahead and connect to that now. <clears throat> have an external antenna. It's got pretty good range. And now it's connected to the internet. <clears throat> so using this Blink app that I made for it, <clears throat> this works through the internet so you could actually have a smoke running and you can run to the grocery store and you'll still get updates on it. See, that's on. So, at the top we have our temperature set point and then our smoke percentage. And if we watch these two, try and get this for you, it updates quite quickly. We can change our smoke. And our alarm temp we have there and then your meat probes you can turn on and off we only have one of them connected right now and then the green button here we have a verify that will run the alarm as well as you get a light back on your screen talks to the controller and sends one back so if you're in your house you have verification that it's working and then right here we have a history graph that's what we were running today holds pretty steady I can see I got to change a little bit of tuning there now that we switched it 240 instead of uh, 110 so a little bit more tuning it's doing good we're gonna change some things the outputs I have right now are not on pulse width modulated capable pins we're gonna switch some things around so we're not going to necessarily have to use electric and then we can do fan output as well and I'll run off of the same thing so that's where we're at right now it works excellent uh, really happy with it not a whole lot I'm going to change so I hope you guys look forward to it and we'll get it out soon